All right, good morning, you guys. It's another great day. Um, April is off shooting pictures for two, for twin newborns. From somebody from our old neighborhood and Zaid went sleigh riding with Doug and Hunter and Dallin and I took the, these three little monkeys to get out of the house we're gonna run some errands we stopped off at Cabela's to uh, feed the fish I don't think we've ever taken Ender here yeah right Ender so it's, it's a pretty cool store you get to feed the fish and they have a lot of dead animals hanging around so we're gonna go look at the dead animals Daisy, where are you? Oh, wow. Yeah. That fish. Say hi, fishy. Is that pretty cool? Wow. Look at all these fishies. Amber, you see another one? Look at all those fish. a lot of fish food, huh? There's still one, one there's still two little fish. Where? Right Are they getting them? There's a tiny fish. There's a tiny fish. Look at those. Dad, I want to see fishy. Yeah, just a polar bear, no big deal. No? Would you let these Stuart eat them? Okay, Andrew thinks he's quite the little daredevil here. Oh, jump! Wow! <laughs> Did you do it? Okay, run around. Show me how fast you are. Go, show me. Just let him run laps here for a while. Okay, jump, Ender. Oh, no, no, no. Jump! Wow! <laughs> Is that fun? Did you jump? This is way better than watching movies at the house. Ah, oh! That's back. <laughs> back already! <laughs> wow, you're back already? That was a close one, Ender. Okay, do it again. Good boy. Okay, Emery wants to jump. Whoa! Hey, two little monkeys. Okay, Daisy, or Emery, I'm go ahead and jump. Wow, Ambry. All right, guys. I feel like I've been missing in action all day. I went and did newborn pictures of twins, which was extremely difficult because they were little avatars. One was awake, one was asleep. When we tried to do pictures together, one was like clawing the other one, sucking on its head. So it was like crazy. But we got some cute ones. And then I went and took some pictures of a house. And that kind of sucked because it was completely full of crap. Like I had to move all the crap from one room to another, just like broken things and garbage <laughs> like it wasn't ready to take pictures let's just say but 
It was a house that was being listed for sale. Yeah, if so we have a realtor. The realtor that actually we are using, sometimes he hires us to take pictures of the houses so he doesn't have to go out and do it. Because ours was better. When, when we were taking pictures of our own house, when we were selling it, we did such great he was pictures. Like, He's like, rock. okay, you, you need guys, to keep yeah. taking these for I was like, I'm paying a guy 50 bucks and they look like crap. I was like, well, we'd, we'd pay a lot, you'd have to pay us more, but it looked good. So he upped his game. But that was a hard house because it was full of crap. I had to like, I took one picture of the kitchen before I moved all the crap, but it's a cute little house. Hopefully it sells. Um, and I decided to go with the beanie for the rest of the day because if you noticed earlier, my hair just wasn't working out. It was pretty embarrassing. If April was with me, she wouldn't have put up with it. Yeah, he had second day, I'm going to try to make this work here. Didn't work. With that hairstyle, like, you got to keep it soft if you want to do hit second day. And his hair is still kind of too short. We're trying to grow it a little bit on top. Um, and now we are heading out to look at paint colors for epoxy floors in our garage. And we're going to look for concrete stain for my salon floor because we wanted to do... We're still debating whether or not to do concrete stain on the entire basement except bedrooms and the theater room. I'm torn. It seems like if we did like a wood flooring, it would be a lot warmer down there and prettier. Definitely in the salon, I'm 100% concrete because we have that entrance and I know water could like seep in a little bit if it snowed or rained really bad. So I'm fine with the concrete in the salon. I think that that's just gonna be easier. But the rest of the house, I kinda wanna do like a like a laminate or wood floor, probably laminate flooring down there, and then carpet in the bedrooms and the theater room. So that's my debate. Like it's super cheap to do the concrete. Whoa, 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 whoa! No fighting. Hi, Ambry. Hi, Ambry. Hi, Ambry. Oh dear. So uh, it's super cheap to do the concrete. That's our debate. Or have it look warmer like I'm just worried that it's just already gonna be so cold down there and the floor will be really cold so I kind of want to do the wood in the kitchen and dining room in the hall in the bathroom what do I do what do you guys think does anyone have a concrete floor in their basement what do you think about it comment below hi guys give me that <laughs> can't get it <laughs> you're gonna break our camera oh. You guys. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Need to clean our house. <laughs> okay, guys. That's it. Um, bad news on our basement. The so plan all along. All of our plans are ruined in the garage and basement. <sighs> Apparently, to do anything to concrete, it needs to be at 50 degrees or 60 degrees, the temperature of the ground, which means it has to be like hot outside. So in order to finish our salon, we have to choose a different kind of flooring. We wanted to stain the cement with acid stain. we're not waiting until May mm -hmm. to finish the salon. We're getting it done ASAP. Which we were excited about because it was going to be like three or $400 for the entire floor in the basement to be stained. And everything would have been pretty. And then we could have finished the whole basement. But now... We're going to have to pay a lot more for like laminate or carpet or both. Which know. is fine because it'll look I nice because April anyway. was kind of scared of the stained yeah. cement Well, anyways, except for I wanted the stained cement for sure in the salon, which I yeah, can't have now. Yeah, because it'll just peel up. So. Yeah, or it will like ruin... I don't know. I guess we could finish the salon and just leave it cement in there and then like stain the floor. But then the water damage would get on the walls and the baseboards and stuff. Anyways, trouble in paradise, guys. But lots of little hiccups with that. Um, if our house would have been done in September like it was supposed to be, then yes, we everything would have been fine. But the we are coming down to the wire. We're supposed to be closing on the house at the end of the month, so mm -hmm. that is very exciting. We can't it can't come soon enough. And yeah. Our kids are in the bathtub laughing really hard. No, so they're, out. Go check. Oh, they're out. Why are they laughing so hard? That's they're so having fun. fun. But hopefully you guys enjoyed our vlog today. Thanks for watching. We love you guys. And we're going <laughs> to say goodnight. Goodnight.